One of my favorite things about ATW are the profiles of people in the community who are doing extraordinary things. Me too, whether they're social media stars, photographers, accessibility advocates, or people who just try to be as involved as possible in their communities. Vancouverite Kathy Brown happens to be all of those things. She's an extraordinary woman who tries to make her community better every day. Our AMI Vancouver team recently had a chance to meet up with Kathy and learn more about her. My name's Kathy Brown. I'm legally blind. I am a PR professional and a social media girl and a photographer. And uh, I am uh, an activist and uh, advocate for disabled people. Born prematurely 63 years ago, Kathy's eye tissues were severely damaged in the incubator, leaving her with less than 10% vision in one eye. As a child, I think the challenges were, were greater because you tend to be bullied uh, if you're different in any way. And unfortunately, there have been times I've been bullied in the workplace too, which is, which is also difficult. But you know, when you balance things out, I've been pretty blessed. Well, she's a great girl. We love her to death. Her love for photography has helped many people in the city take notice of Kathy always with a camera in hand and a stylish hat on her head. But her unique style and perspective didn't develop until a special trip. 10 years ago, I had the opportunity to visit Taiwan and Japan. And before I left, I decided that I wasn't going to just shoot the same old touristy photos. This was going to be my opportunity to really tell a story with pictures. And also then, for those pictures to become kind of my memory bank, when I got back, I could refer to them and actually pick up details and situations that I actually wasn't really seeing at the time. I'm not sure it's a unique perspective because of the eyesight. I think it's more a unique perspective because of all the years of concentrating on details because I had to. Kathy's presence in the city expands beyond photographing high-profile events and places. She's a social media guru and can always be found on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, interacting with her wide network of friends. According to Sandra Thomas, travel and lifestyle editor at the Vancouver Courier newspaper, Kathy's many talents make her highly engaging. Initially, I think people are attracted to her because of her, her, her kindness, her wit. She's a lot of fun, but then once they get to know her and they realize the power of her writing, the power of her photography, and the power that she has in um, her commitment to this city, I think people realize that Kathy Brown is an influencer of her own, and I think people are, are interested in spending time with her. Having such wide social appeal has made Kathy an effective advocate for people living with disabilities. Vancouver City Councilor Andrea Reimer says that Kathy's impact as Vice Chair of the Persons with Disabilities Advisory Committee is noticeable and credits Kathy's attitude and empathy as key reasons. Although her personal challenge is around sight and being visually impaired, um, she sees the problem of the mobility challenge, of the hearing challenge, whatever the challenge is. She's very sensitive to how other people are feeling in a group and I think that's a rare enough skill in the modern world. Um, doesn't always come with social media guru because <laughs> sometimes if you're very comfortable online, you're not as sensitive in the, in the analog world, but she's the whole thing. For Kathy, putting herself out in the community, whether online or outside, has had a positive effect. It's helped her overcome life's challenges and is something she thinks everyone can learn from. No matter how negative social media can get, I've been very lucky to be blessed with people who really care. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Try things. You know, try, try new things. So what if it doesn't work? You know, make new friends. Talk more. Ask more questions. I mean, there's so many things that people can do to make their lives better. It was great hearing Kathy open up about herself and her life. I hope we see more of her in the future. Well, there's a good chance you will. 
especially if you watch ATW, because when our Vancouver team shows up at any event about inclusion, accessibility, or empowerment, it's likely Kathy's going to be there. For more information about Kathy and her work, check out her website at kathybrown.com. Now, important to note, that's Kathy with a C and Brown ending with an E.